Hello everybody and welcome to week 9 of the NCL, um, the Nimbasa City League, and uh, this week I'm playing TJ and uh, the NA, uh, I think because he doesn't have a team logo or a team name at the moment, he's been working on one or having someone work on one or something, and he hasn't got it yet, so uh, that's just how it is. Um, I'm looking at his team now and it looks pretty scary, the Zapdos, the... Um, Reggie Rock, Reggie Steele, Suicune, um, the Keldeo and the uh, Tornadus, I believe. Yep. Um, and then we've got Zygarde, Salazzle, um, Mega Pidgeot, uh, Aerodactyl, Kecleon, and the uh, Serena on my side, so. I think getting rocks up is pretty, pretty important, though he does have like defog that can get rid of it on the zap dose, uh, and he has the potential to get his own rocks up with like the Reggie Steel and stuff as well. I guess I could lead off with my Salazzle here, or Zygarde try and get a Dragon Dance up straight up. Um, my sets are below me. Um, under my webcam if you want to have a closer look at what I'm bringing and uh, try and figure out why. I mean if you want to know why I brought something um, then potentially uh, leave me a comment or something like that so anyway I think maybe getting my own rocks up is a good idea as he does leave the Zapdos um, Which is kind of annoying, but let's see what we can do with that, huh? Uh, I don't know if I really want to get a fake um, fake out off here. Because, like, that's a high chance of getting static. Um, I'm assuming it's going to try and get up screens or something like that. And I didn't bring the defog to deal with that at all, so... Um, so I'm just going to get my Stealth Rocks up. Is he going to Thunderbolt? Not going to do a ton to us. Uh, I guess I can recover up here, as he's going to get the paralysis on the thunderbolt, but, um, so if he's going to keep thunderbolting, I'm just going to go into Zygarde, thunderbolt won't touch us, I can dragon dance, he can go HP ice, and give us our weakness policy. It's not going to kill us, so... Um, let's see... Zygarde... What's that? That should be plus three attack. There's Zapdos. Oh, has a chance to kill. Decent chance to kill. I guess I just go for the Thousand Arrows here and hope. That's annoying, actually. Legitimately, like, the minister roll needed. Aerodactyl's gonna be faster than this. Can Aerodactyl proc, proc his weakness policy without dying? No. No, it cannot. Oops. Alright. Now, what did Fake Out do here? 12%. Shadow Sneak will do more. Um, 
What do I want to get cures on? <laughs> Aerodactyl or... I guess I'll try and get the kills onto the Aerodactyl here. <sighs> Actually, I probably shouldn't have risked this. I'm going to get paralyzed now, and that's going to be uh, pretty annoying, actually. <laughs> no paralysis? Paralysis? No paralysis. Good, good, good. Tell I just lost Zygarde there, that's so annoying. Alright, what's Keldeo going to do? Keldeo is probably going to be Scarfed or something, right? I'm not going to outspeed, and he's just going to destroy me with a Scald or a Hydro Pump, so I'm guessing that um, Serena's probably my switch in here. The icy winds. Oh, that's some crazy tech. All right. Whoops. Wrong one. Uh, icy wind. Should have expected something like that, huh? Uh, Forty-one point three. So actually, could be specs. I don't want to lose Serena right now. Um, what does Kecleon take? Yeah, that's most likely specs. That sucks. Um, I should have recovered, to be honest. Um, hmm. says I seem to have angered the hax gods and uh, yeah pretty much the story of my life What is Serena going to do here? Even a power whip's not going to take this thing out, unfortunately. But it's the best I can do. Okay, so he's going to be faster than us. Um. <sighs> I don't know. Ah, uh, right, Tailwind. Should have should have thought about that. Um, well, all I can do now is hope.
This is gonna rock polish up, okay. So that did... He's not HP, he's gotta be speed. Probably, probably max attack actually, so Stone Edge is gonna wreck my day. Nothing I can do here, to be honest. I needed my rocks. Um, what's Salazzle gonna do here? Nothing. Uh, I don't even think Pidgeot can uh, come back here. That just went downhill when Zygarde just, like, died. Um, yeah, uh, I don't know, like, he had some neat tech that I wasn't expecting, for sure, um... An offensive Regirock is pretty... The Icy Wind... On the Keldeo with the Specs... Um, Tailwind. I should have recovered and got my Stealth Rocks up earlier, but or also, like, I didn't need to go for the Shadow Sneak on the Tornadus there. Uh, but also, like, I was going to get my Rocks up. Um, but I'd got, like, parried, like, five times. Not much you can do about that. Some sometimes you just have the luck, and sometimes you don't. And my luck just was not with me today. Like it isn't a lot of days, I guess. Like Zygarde had a decent chance of just like fully sweeping from that point. To be honest, like I'm not really. I mean, I'm not really sure if Zygarde would have. Zygarde would have taken out Regirock. Probably not Registeel if it's physically defensive. Okay, it would have taken out Registeel if it was physically defensive. Uh, let's see. Suicune. Wouldn't have taken out Suicune, but... And that probably would have been what came in next. What about Keldeo? Would have taken out Keldeo. I mean, depending on the Suicune set. Like, if it was an offensive Suicune, 
it had the potential to knock it out at plus three. Um, and like everything except the Suicune would have gone down at that point to my um, Zygarde. Like, assuming that he's not specifically prepped for that, like, max defense, max HP on some things, or something like that, but, um, it's a bit annoying, and, like, not having anything to be able to set up in front of with Aerodactyl kind of sucked as well. Like, Specs, Keldeo would have, like, murdered it. Non-Specs, Keldeo would have murdered it, probably, as well. Um, Kecleon getting paralyzed a lot sucked. Salazzle couldn't do anything. Uh, he kind of needed a Reggie Steel or something to get a hit off. Um, like everything he brought walled Salazzle besides the Reggie Steel and Tornado Steel to take in a chunk, but um, same with the Mega Pidgeot to be honest. Like Keldeo uh, is the only thing that's weak to it here. And then Serena could have put in work as well, but I let that take too much damage with the Icy Wind. I wasn't expecting that, for sure. Um, but yeah, alright, I'll take that loss. Uh, it's two losses in a row. I think that makes me 5-4. I believe that's 5-4, which is kind of frustrating, because I definitely was in a position to win that with the Zygarde, for sure. Um, but, what can you do? He did more than that, I believe. So he might have even been, like, expert belt. Something like that. It seems about how much it probably did. Everything was just downhill from there, to be honest. Um, 83%. Oh, wrong one. So, yeah, that could have been... Could have been a modest HP ice with expert belt. Could have been just a max modest HP ice. Either way, like thousand arrows was yeah. Like he's got to have had the HP and potentially the speed as well, but could have just been max HP, max special attack with a little bit of speed or something. Nope, he needed that 8 defense as well. I guess 4 defense maybe, let him live it too. Okay, so he needed that 4 defense to help him live that. Crazy. Alright, well, thanks for watching, guys, and uh, hopefully I can start pulling back and still make it to playoffs. So, yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you all later. Peace.